five, four, three, two. Good morning, Clear Falls. I'm Jack. And I'm Angel. Welcome to Night Vision. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Here's a peek at your need to know info. Crown, nah, I'm lightning fast. Uh, give me my cash. Uh, I do what I say. Uh, spit it straight to your face. Uh, I never back down. I'm here with two captains of the Clear Falls football team, quarterback Gavin Esquivel and outside linebacker Kobe Walker. Kobe, let's start with you. What does this playoff appearance mean for your team in the school? Uh, I think it means a lot to bring everybody together and uh, get them rallied behind something. So uh, I think it's almost everything. It is everything, you know. Gavin, tell us all it's took to be successful this year. Um, just hard work and dedication, uh, trusting our teammates, and um, just relying on, relying on the coaches. Game is going to be this Friday at Clear Creek. Y'all all need to come out, show support. Don't be like this high school student who doesn't know what they're going to do after high school. Searching. Searching. If you need help, Gentex can help you. I teach the junior ROTC program here. I teach credit recovery right now. I am actually an alpha counselor. I teach Army JROTC. Well, I used to teach English. I went to Hardin-Simmons University in Abilene. And for undergrad, I went to the University of Texas at El Paso, and for my master's, I went through um, SFA. I majored in psychology. I majored in kinesiology, which is a uh, fancy name for physical education. Uh, and then took a minor in English. My college journey experience was long. Um, when I was receiving my bachelor's degree, I had two tiny little children. So I was a mom already, and so it took me a little longer. And then when I was doing my master's degree, I was teaching full-time, had kids, and did um, school at night. Well, I started off with um, two full-ride scholarships to school, and my first semester I failed a math class and ended up um, losing my scholarship. So it turned out I had to um, finish school. I went through summer school with um, community colleges and tried to advance and get through faster that way and less expensive. But um, I finished in the four years, and here we are now. I would say um, exercise patience, time management, um, self-management, and self-discipline and perseverance. After high school is to get some certification and some training of, of some type, wherever you, that may be. Whether that be college for, for many, uh, that's a great path. Uh, but whether it's a trade school or something, you've got to have extra training beyond just the high school level. Well, just like myself, the military officer is a great opportunity, but there's different um, abilities to attend college out there based on um, not only the military, but agriculture, FFA, many other options that just don't, you know, aren't presented all the time. So don't give up on that just traditional college route. Today, a representative from Texas Tech and a rep from San Jacinto College will be visiting our campus. Any junior or senior interested can visit the College Center to find out more about these colleges. 
Calling all juniors. You are formally invited to attend the Class of 2021 ring ceremony in the Performing Arts Center on December 4, 2019 at 6.30 p.m. To participate in this event, you must register with Ms. Roden in the College and Career Center by November 18th at 4 p.m. See Mrs. Walker in House 1 for more information. Tomorrow show our Night Nation pride by wearing everything clear falls. What's in store for you when you graduate high school? Be sure to take pictures in the comments with your counselors. Use the hashtag CFHS Gentex. Calling all laughter. Yes, that means yours. Come see the improv show this Thursday at 6 p.m. in the Performing Arts Center. Tickets are just $5. Don't miss out on the hilarity. There will be an NEHS meeting after school today in Miss Nuggets room, 5315. If you have not returned your text communication form, please bring it with you to turn in at the meeting. The Spanish Club is having a meeting this Friday after school in room 4524 with Mrs. Vasquez. We will have food and games, so come and make new amigos. Teachers are welcome as well. Hosa will have a meeting today in room 4408. See you there. The General Arts Club is searching for new members. If you're curious, come to Mr. Torres room, 5518 in house two. Meetings are Tuesday and Thursdays from 3.30 p.m. to 4.15 p.m. Do you have a pet peeve? Uh, yeah, I do have a pet. No, not a, no, a pet peeve. Uh, yeah, its name is Peeve. No, not a pet name, Peeve. You make no L sense. Ugh. You're not understanding what I'm saying. When people tap on their binder, Okay. People tapping their foot while taking a test. Hello? Can you stop tapping your foot, please? It's so distracting. I'm trying to take a test here. Erica, are you yelling during a no. test? No, Mrs. B, she was No, you're not supposed foot. to be talking during a test. No. Give me your no, test right now. No, test. do not no. argue with me. No. You're not no. arguing with me. Teacher's pet. La, 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 oh, la, la, la. hi, Erica. Oh. Hey, Mrs. P, how are you doing? Hi, hi. You know, you can have anything you want. Oh, you want, you want I, my I ID? I really don't need your ID. <laughs> Take it. You want my credit I card? I don't need your credit card. Take it. Card. Buy yourself no, some I, I Gucci. I don't need that. Make yourself look no, I'm, nice. I'm um, oh, you need my blood? Okay, get away from me. You need me? my blood. Okay, Here. Principal. Here. Take it. Principal, can Take I get it. the ah! Right, class. What is two times four divided by two? Okay, well, um... 2 times 4 equals 8, and then you divide that by 2, so the answer is 4. Actually, Erica, that's not how you do it. 2 times 4, reduce the 2 by 2, reduce the 4 by 2, 1 times 2 equals 2, you big idiot. Dude, why do you always have to know every little thing? Why do you always have to be such a smart astronaut? Being called on on class when you didn't even have your hand All up. right, class, what is three times three? Don't pick me. Let's see, let's see, everybody else has their hand up. Except for Erica. Really? I'm not even sitting in my chair. Go ahead, um, answer You're the question. You're still gonna pick me. Can you please answer um, me? I didn't mean to do that, I'm sorry. Um, um. Think, why won't you think? Come on, you know the answer. The answer is nine. The answer is nine. The answer is nine. The answer is um, six? Actually, no. No! Tell me like a dog. Speak. <laughs> Woof. Hi, I'm Mr. Herpin. I teach Algebra 2 and College Prep Math. So when I was in school, I came from a, like a rough background, and sometimes I felt like my teachers were and coaches were the only people who I really had to kind of lean on, so that's why I'm even doing this. If you weren't teaching, what else would you be doing? I've thought about that a lot. Um, I just know that right now, this is where I'm supposed to be. Uh, I just think that, I don't know if I want to go into administration, be a principal, I don't know if I want to go into curriculum, but what holds me, what holds me back from not knowing if I want to go to administration or not is I really teach to have an impact on kids and see them every single day and teaching fills my bucket and it makes me happy and I'm able to come home and, and be a good dad and a good husband, at least I think. And um, I don't know if I would still feel the same way if I was in another job. 
I just really like coming to school and making people's day. We love Coach Herpin. I also taught in Africa. Calling all juniors, you are formally invited to attend the Class of 2021 Ring Ceremony. Located in the Pouring Arts Center on December 4th, 2019 at 6.30pm. To participate in this event, you must register with Ms. Rodden and College and Career Center by November 18th at 4pm. See Ms. Walker for more information. I'm here with Jake. I'm here with I on to you. What's up? I'm here with Liz. Kobe King. What's up? I'm young Jay Swish. And I'm Josh Jones. We're gonna be asking some questions on the street. Let's get into it. How do you feel about Frederick Douglass dropping 50 on the Rockets last night? Dang, I know bro was hooping like that. Ooh. On God Hunt. 50, a 50 piece. That's crazy. I saw it. I thought I saw that on Twitter too. I thought I was like, I like all right, Liz, what do you think about Kid Patowski's new program that will ban drooling in the United States? I mean, it's not going to totally stop it, but I get it. Like, I understand it and everything. But, I mean, if kids want to do it, they're still going to do it. All right, Ion, I got a question for you, bro. What's up, bro? How do you feel about Senator Kevin Love passing the bill for seven days of school a week? I don't know who that is, bro. Senator Kevin Love. Who? Kevin Love. Kevin who? Love. Kevin Hart? What was the question? <laughs> All right, Kobe, how do you feel about Professor Tinky Winky's policy to increase taxes by 25%? Professor Tinky Winky, he ain't it. Why not? What, is it because of the color of his skin? <laughs> no, it's definitely not that. <laughs> no, I had to walk over there to try to get Anthony back out here. Back, 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 back out here. Yeah, so I walked back out here with Jake. <laughs> okay. On what year? In what year did Floyd Mayweather sign the Constitution? I know who Donald Trump and Barack Obama is. I don't know who Senator Love is, bro. This week begins Clearfall's month-long campaign to change the culture about mental health, mental illness, and wellness. If everyone is more open and honest about mental health, we can prevent pain and suffering, and those in need will get the help they deserve. It's important to know the five signs of changes in emotional well-being. Sign 1. Personality change. Sign 2. Unusual agitation. Sign 3. Becoming withdrawn. Sign 4. Having poor self-care. Sign 5. Hopelessness. If you recognize that someone in your life is suffering, now what? You connect, you reach out, you inspire hope, and you offer help. Show compassion and a caring and a willingness to find a solution when the person may not have the will or drive to help him or herself. There are many resources in our communities. It takes more than one offer, and you may need to reach out to others who share your concern about the person who is suffering. If you notice or have concern about someone in your life, reach out. Contact a counselor, principal, teacher, or other trusted adult. Help is available. Look through the halls to find a poster. If you need a reminder, remember to follow our counselors on Instagram at CFHS Counseling and on Twitter at CFHS underscore counselor. Next week, find out how to take the pledge to know the five signs of emotional suffering. Let's change the culture surrounding mental health and mental illness. Promote wellness for your friends, family, neighbors, and yourself. Chess Club is on Mondays from 2.45 to 3.45. You can learn um, new chess ideas. You get free food every week. And um, I mean, it's pretty fun. Lego Cross Angels Lab. Alright, Dylan, what's your favorite thing on Girlfriends? 
about falls, Clear Falls? Everything. Would you say you love Clear Falls? I love Clear Falls. What is it? Oh, I thought that was Angel doing that. <laughs> I'm like, Angel, why are you doing that? Yeah. Uh, hot. DJ. Clear Falls is my favorite school, I like it more than yours You can try to be better, but I'll just kick you out the door You wanna be better than us, you have to try harder than us Please stop putting up of us, you'll never be a just like us Clear Falls is my favorite school, Clear Falls is my favorite school Clear Falls is my favorite school, ooh, 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 ooh Clear Falls is my favorite school, Clear Falls is my favorite school Clear Falls is my favorite school, ooh Clear Falls is my favorite school. 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 I like it more than yours. You can try to be better, but I just kick you out the door. You wanna be better than us? You have to try harder than us. Please stop putting up a fuss. You will never be a just like us. Yeah, please. <laughs> just make sure you keep the bathrooms locked. It's my favorite part. Yeah, make sure you just never open the bathrooms. I love when they're locked. That's all for this episode of Night Vision. Remember to catch us next week. And as always, it's, it's a, a great, great day, day to, to be a night. night. <laughs>